The Loud and Casa Grande family members come in all shapes and sizes. But who's the tallest and shortest out of all of them? Let's start with the youngest member of the Casa Grande family. He may be the shortest, but that doesn't stop him from keeping his family safe. It's Carlitos. Ah! <laughs> no, no, no! I'm running! Really? <laughs> no! Not the duct tape! Okay, come back! Oh. The next tallest is the youngest Loud, and a prankster in training. It's Lily. <laughs> Watch this. We're locked in! <laughs> oh no! She rigged Benzilla to drive around on an endless loop! Forever. <gasps> That's really dark. Funny, but dark. One size up, this Loud has the biggest brain out of everyone. It's Lisa. Science! The next two characters are the same height and even have their own secret language. It's Lola and Lana. Lana, you told me you fixed it. I did, calm down. You're being such a schmirkin' beagle. <gasps> That's funny coming from a real figgle snaggle. Uh, uh, come again? The next tallest character might owe some of his height to his hair. It's Carl. Please let me cut your hair. If I don't get my certificate, I won't be able to work at that celebrity spa place this summer. Oh, well in that case, no. I've got a hair guy. Come on, I need you, little bro. <laughs> Enough to clean my room for a month. Two weeks. Three weeks! And do my homework for a month. One week of cleaning. No homework, but I'll show you where Abuela hides her candy. Deal! Just don't tell my hair guy. This next character dresses all in black and actually wouldn't mind being a vampire. It's Lucy. Just think, one bite from him and we'll never have to wait for another season of Vampires of Melancholia, because we'll be living it. We can be just like Edwin forever. Da -da -da. Some for you, and for you, a lot for you, and some fresh own egg for Count Lucila. <laughs> garlic bread, Lucy? Yes. Oh yeah, forgot the no garlic thing. Family picture time. Oops, forgot, Lucy doesn't show up. <laughs> <laughs> this next one you probably know best of all. The man who always has a plan, it's Lincoln. We're gonna find out who wronged Chef Pat? We'll need to use the three Ds of detective work. Diligence, distraction, and disguise. We may not find the answer tonight, or tomorrow, or even this week. But when we do, all of our hard work will be worth it. Next up, she's about the only one who can match Lincoln's pranking skills. It's Ronnie Ann. Special delivery for Ronnie Ann. Nice try, Lincoln. Happy prank anniversary. The faulty floorboard trick? What is this, amateur hour? I was just warming up. Our next tallest is all about fitness and has a unique take on the smoothie. It's Lynn. Da -da, fruit, carbs, and ham. All the food groups. <laughs> just a few inches taller, this next character loves everything about pirates. It's CJ. Get ready to be shock babe. Next up, one of this character's special skills is riding bulls. It's Hector Casagrande. <laughs> hey, Abuelo is pretty good. Go, Abuelo! Go, Abuelo! <laughs> Wrong day to wear red chonies, Abuelo. Uh oh. The next one takes multitasking to a whole other level. It's Rosa. 
There we go, Senor Toaster. We'll get ten more years out of you yet. Bueno, the toilet's doing what? I'll be right there. About the only thing this next character takes seriously are her puns. It's Luann. Those lyrics make no frankincense. What's that, Mom? I can hardly hear you. Look at Dad getting figgy with it. You are missile totally busted. Ooh, I'm gonna tell. No, no, no. Just ribbon ya. Well, there's no time like the present. <laughs> Lily, are you stalking me? <laughs> the next one might not be as tall as Mick Swagger, but her voice definitely measures up. It's Luna Loud. Is it hard? Yes, absolutely. I'm just doing double duty. Doing double duty. Yes, we're taking the rest. Working on my booty. Just doing double duty. Next up, this Casa Grande knows everything about social media. It's Carlota. Yes, it came. Eyeliner, lashes. <gasps> no way. I even got the shadow palette. Whoop de doo Where are you even getting money for all this stuff? Do you get more allowance than me? No, I don't pay for it. I review makeup on my vlog, and the companies send me stuff for free. The next loud isn't the smartest in the group, but she is the ninth tallest. It's Lenny. Yay, cake! Is it my birthday? You, Lenny Loud, are Reininger's employee of the month. <laughs> it's my birthday and I'm employee of the month! <laughs> it's just the second one, Len. This next character spends a lot of her time behind the wheel. It's Lori Loud. I can put my ice chai here, my golf clubs in the back. It's like this car was made for me. Can you imagine pulling up to Fairway University in this? <sighs> that ride is so nice, I'll park it for free! <laughs> The next one often goes by the name Boo Boo Bear, though he once thought he was a cat. It's Bobby. I'm ready for you, gatos. Meow. Bobby? You brought me a papaya. Gracias, Bobbito. How did I get up here? Um, are you okay, Bobby? Oh, hey! The next tallest character loves exploring other cultures. It's Maria. A walk around our block is basically a trip around the world. First stop, Korea. And this was the tea ceremony. <laughs> Thank you for taking me on the best vacation ever. From photography to sculptures to painting, this next character is the most artistic of the group. It's Frida. I would never give up my art. Yes, the review hurt a little, but artists must have a thick skin. But we saw you crying earlier. Oh, that. I was channeling all my pain into my new pieces. Paintings infused with my tears. This next character knows a list of facts about almost everything. It's Carlos. If I'm reading correctly, this letter was written by Pancho Villa. Pancho who? Ay, what are they teaching you in school? He's only one of the most famous generals of the Mexican Revolution. The letter must have belonged to my great-great-grandfather. He rode with Pancho Villa. Legend has it, Pancho Villa buried his gold, but no one's ever found it. Until now, we're gonna be rich. This next character may be a doctor, but has also been known to judge hot dogs. It's Arturo. Thank you for your <laughs> famous burp dog. <laughs> next, we have Hector's Mercado dog. Beautiful color. The buns are warm and fluffy. Now for the taste. Mm. <laughs> Fantastico. <laughs> eight uh -huh. out of ten. <laughs> Did I say eight? I meant nine. Who made this bobo a judge? Even though this next character is the second tallest, she once disguised herself as a high school student. It's Rita. Welcome to the Loud House. Oh, wow. <gasps> Lana, what are you doing? Don't freak. I'll have a 
cleaned up before Mom gets home? <laughs> oh, and that's our dad. Hey, hey, girls, I didn't hear you come. <gasps> <gasps> Not cool, Dad. This is our friend Britta. Oh, sorry, Britta. Got some in your ponytail, dude. And finally, the tallest out of everyone, this loud loves to rock out with his cowbell. It's Lynn Sr. Follow my lead. <laughs>